everybody, including TBX. I want something. I want you guys to clear me up on something, man. Maybe I, maybe it's something that I'm fucking missing, man. Uh, um, maybe I'm not clear on the situation that's in hand with this R. Kelly shit. Um, if it's not my, if I'm not mistaken, R. Kelly went to trial, beat his charges. And got acquitted of all his charges. And now they bring it back the same tape that they used in that trial for this trial. To me, that's double jeopardy. Or, or, or am I tripping? Or am I tripping? Is that not double jeopardy? Or maybe some laws or some shit been changed since then. But I know that they can't try you twice. I know this. So what the fuck are we doing here, people? What are we doing? Well, I mean, this makes no fucking sense to me. How the fuck is this man being charged again for some shit that he already beat? I thought I thought the tape was a, a new goddamn tape. They got that same fucking VHS fucking shit. Probably downloaded onto a goddamn DVD. How the fuck could they bring the same tape and try and try this man again? How is this fucking possible? Or maybe it's something that I'm fucking missing. Maybe, maybe my shit ain't clear on what's going on. But I know for a fact... That the double jeopardy is real. And there's no way you can be tried twice. Hence, the why OJ came out with the book, if I would have killed her, this is how I would have been done. So I'm not... And don't get me wrong, I'm not sticking up, for, you know, pedophile, you should be fucking burned in hell and you need to go fucking meet your goddamn maker. But it's a thing called due process. And innocent until proven guilty. And laws on double jeopardy. There's no way you can be tried twice. What kind of game is they playing right now, people? Now, is it bring down any black man by any means necessary? I thought shit had a statute of limitations on it. Going back to Bill Cosby. I, maybe I'm the only one that's uh, noticing this, man. Maybe I'm the only one that's noticing this, because I know for a fact you can't be tried twice. That's double jeopardy. And they bring it over the same ass tape with the same girl who now is of age. Now, she got to be at least in her fucking 30s. In her mid-30s. And now, what, is she going to say, did they get to her? And maybe said, um, we'll pay you this much if you um, go back on what you said. But then that would be, if she go back on what she said, then that would be perjury, right? Or am I, I could be tripping. But if she go back on what she said back then, and now say, he did it, that was me, that was him in the film, I was 14. Would that be perjury on her end? Maybe I'm mixed up here, man, but shit ain't fitting for me, man. 
And no, I'm not protecting no goddamn pedophile. I'm not. But shit should have been done years ago. The man beat his case. Let him go. What the fuck are they doing? Oh. That's right. Surviving R. Kelly. All that came out on R. Kelly. And now they feel like they've been pinned in the corner to where they had to do something. Because where did this imaginary tape come from? Where did this imaginary tape come from out of nowhere? Out of thin... Came out of nowhere. Why this didn't come out years ago? After the surprise? So somebody was just sitting on it? Or somebody just sitting on Like, I'm going to hold this. I'm going to hold this, you know what I'm saying, for when R. Kelly fuck up. Which goes back to my question. Isn't there a statute of limitations? How can they try this man for some shit he beat in 08? Keep your eyes open, man. Be careful. Do the three S's. Like Big Facts Podcast say. Shout out Big Facts Podcast. Practice them three S's, man. That's the only way you're going to be safe out here till we get any of this shit straight. Because they bamming niggas on shit that they beat already. And this is this is scare y'all even more. This is this is scare y'all even more. And this is straight to my black man. This is scare y'all even more. Think about this. They bammed Bill Cosby. So what the fuck are you? They bammed Bill Cosby. Look up Bill Cosby's um, net worth. With some of the best attorneys in the game couldn't get this nigga shit dropped. Bill Cosby is in jail, y'all. Wake the fuck up. He in jail. Bill Cosby. I could just imagine what they would have did if Richard Pryor was still alive. Ponder on that. She ain't no fucking game out here, man. They killing us off one by one. Starting from the top to the fucking bottom. And y'all out here still playing. Still thinking this shit a fucking game. Until it lands on your fucking front porch. Think, y'all. Think. If a man with as much money as Bill Cosby had on a frivolous ass case with no fucking evidence, no fucking evidence, what the fuck you think they gonna do to you? They didn't have no circumstantial evidence for fucking Bill Cosby. None. They had a bitch say she took a pill and that he woke up with her shit fucked up or some shit. They didn't have nothing. That shit happened back in the fucking 80s and fucking 70s and 80s. I think they said into the 90s too. But just, I mean, think about it, man. Bill Cosby. Fat Albert. The Cosby Show, I Spy, Flip Wilson, y'all watch yourself, man. 
They trumping up charges on everybody, man. They not giving a fuck. Money and nothing, because it's past money. Because we all know money don't have no fucking value. Y'all don't hear me. Y'all think about this R. Kelly shit. Really sit back and put your heart away and think about it with your mind. Not your heart, your mind. And think about why it's only the black man going to jail for this shit when it's a whole bunch of other ones that did it too. But who have we seen? Who have we seen? If they take away Bill Cosby, the wholesome, clean cut Bill Cosby, on some charges, that's from when God knows when, with that ugly, tall ass bitch that was one who got the case sealed for him, was a bitch that looked like that? A bitch that like that got the case sealed for Cosby. I don't know, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think. I think this shit is getting out of fucking hand. And we need to start paying more fucking attention to what's going on instead of fucking beefing on this shit. Because we about to be fucking kicked off the goddamn chessboard. I'm out.